Hello everyone and happy Sabbath. My name is Iris and we are currently in Campo Seventh-day Adventist Church here in Camotes Island, Cebu. And right now we are having a digital evangelism training. And alongside with me, I have Liz, I have Rhea and Kuya Barun, who is hosting the trainings here in Camotes Island in Cebu. Now that I'm here, I can really see the need of the young people in terms of digital evangelism and how to actually use social media to win souls for Christ. It's a shame for me to say that I came here unprepared, but the Lord really used this experience for me, not only to bring more souls to Christ, but to bring myself closer to Christ. I'm Elizabeth and I'm a volunteer with Avenus World Radio's Center for Digital Evangelism. I was part of the team that went to Cebu to conduct digital evangelism training on Camotes Island. Before my lecture started, I was feeling a little nervous, but really excited to share the information about digital evangelism. So after my first lecture ended, I was curious like if people had understood in the audience and if they had been inspired to use the information to do something with their own personal evangelism. Um, and so it was an interesting feeling knowing that I had shared that and hoping that the audience would be able to take it to heart and do it with their own lives. After our lectures, we had a question and answer time and it really made us have to think on our feet because they were asking good questions and really deep questions. It was an interesting experience because I wasn't really prepared for the questions they had but we all worked together as a team to try to give them our perspective on their questions. And it was good to see that they were ingesting the information and had thoughts about it and wanted to know more. So that was really gratifying. So my experience before the lectures, I was honestly so, so very anxious because I'm the type of person who likes to be prepared, especially when it comes to speaking. It's not my strongest suit. I remember praying in my head and in my heart, and I was really asking for the Lord to be present there and that I would be able to present the information that the youth would need. So we had a question and answer, a column or session. They actually had so much to say and I was pleasantly surprised and a little bit pressured because, you know, and I was just like, Lord, <laughs> please give us the right things to say. And you know, the Lord is good. So he, he cleared our thoughts and allowed us to speak our heart and our mind and also praise him in everything that we did. Honestly, I'm very thankful to the Lord for giving me this opportunity because it helped me realize how much He can work through me to reach out to others and to teach them the lessons He wishes me to say. Um, and it just reminds me of what Pastor Lex and Pastor Jeter and everyone here has experienced, which is God qualifies the call. I am very blessed because of the messages and the lectures about uh, digital evangelism, about how we deal with uh, the people and the internet, about comments positively and uh, proactively, like preaching the gospel through the internet and through the social media platforms. So I am very blessed and thankful to the Lord that um, I was able to uh, listen and be part of this training. Thank you. Happy Sabbath, everyone. I'm so blessed today because AWR CDE came here to give us lectures about digital evangelism. I am so very blessed because AWR CDE visited Campo Church. I know that social media plays a vital role in our society, especially in the generation today. Uh, we use our accounts and social media platforms to spread God's word. During the Sabbath, I'm so blessed because I hear many words that can ins inspire myself in order for me to do some digital ministry, in order for me to spread the gospel, especially those people will hear the word of God, will draw themselves 
to our Savior. I'm so blessed and thank you. I am so blessed that we're having the missionaries from AWR CDE and their topics this day can help us to communicate to the outside world who needs the Lord's presence in their lives. I was blessed this uh, lecture because I learned that you can use social media to preach the gospel, to spread the gospel, and to hasten Jesus' coming. I'm so blessed this wonderful Sabbath because I've learned in this seminar the proper way how to use social media. Hi, I'm Jeter from Adventist World Radio Center for Digital Evangelism. We are so blessed that we were invited to go to Kamutis Island. The moment that we were there, together with the four missionaries, on that Sabbath, we had a beautiful experience. They made a greater impact to the digital ministry to Kamutis Island young people. I was humbled to give the message. It delivers me, it gives me more humbleness. When Pastor Bonden Sanchez was introducing me that I was just a student by him before at CPAC. Our four missionaries, Baron, Iris, Rhea, and Elizabeth, they offered themselves. They really gave a wonderful lectures and there were some question and answers portions and they were able to answer all the questions. And the result of this in the afternoon, there was a meeting in the Youth Federation of Masbate. And by the grace of God, under the leadership of Pastor Harold, the Youth Director of Central Design Conference, they made the decision to invite the AWR CDE missionaries to spearhead and to be the speaker, to be the lecturers of that Youth Federation in whole Masbate that will compressed of two to three thousand young people in that island please continue to pray for us and wherever you go always put jesus will be the center of your ministry god bless you and more power Amen.